The Department of Arts and Culture, Government of Meghalaya, in collaboration with Indian Council for Cultural Relations, today organized the state launch of Har Ghar Tiranga at a program held at Uso Sotham Auditorium, Shillong. Education Minister Lakhman Rumboy graced the occasion as the chief guest and Chief Secretary D.P. Walang as the guest of honor. Speaking on the occasion, the minister said that the campaign emphasizes the importance of our national flag as the country celebrates 75 years of Indian independence and Meghalaya completes 50 years of statehood. He also thanked Prime Minister Narendra Modi for reminding the people that the national flag is the pride of the nation. I'm very thankful to our Honorable Prime Minister Narendra Modi who remind us that national flag is the pride of nation. Flag is on occasion. But now we realize that as an Indian, we have to preserve, we have to value our national treasure, our national symbol, our pride as the flag. So my dear friend, this is just part of our duty. This is just a part of our uh, service or, as I said, duty to respect the nation, which gives so much, which gives so much. No country in the world could give as much as our India give to its citizen. The freedom we have is, is cannot be compared with any parts of the world in spite of diversity. Yes, we cannot say that we have a perfect constitution. But our constitution is very flexible. That, and it is also dynamic to see the need of the people without disturbing the basic fabric of the constitution, which illustrate even in the color of the flag. So as, an, as the citizen of the country, we should be proud of our country. We should be proud of our state. We should be proud of our house. We should be proud of ourselves. Proud in the sense that, as I said, we are not living in a, so to say, it's a perfect atmosphere. We are, we are, not a perfect citizen, but through the cooperation, through the mutual understanding, we could polish any age which bring the contradiction or which could brought us the difference as the citizen of the state or the citizen of the country. So on this occasion, where we are celebrating this Har Ghar Tiranga. I wish each and every citizen of the country, I wish the people of the state that the movement, this part of the movement, to integrate the symbol of the country into our way of life. The teaching of the our forefather, especially the meaning of the flag and the meaning of the sport, the colors of the flag. As a student, you should read, remember, and try to live as it is. So with these few words, once again, I congratulate the government of India, our honorable prime minister who has dedicated this day as the day of the Har Ghar Tiranga, I wish that in these three days that 
uh, the tricolor will break all the record of the Guinness Book of Record or any record where in the, the first time in the whole world that one color, the Indian flag, fly the highest number which nobody could be in the future. Thank you very much. God bless you. you. DP Walang in his address said that the launching of the program comes under the aegis of Azadik Amrit Mohotsav to celebrate 75 years of India's independence. For the first time, they've relaxed the flag code and allowed all the citizens to have the flag to be launched and hoisted in their personal residence and that too for a period of three days from the 13th of August, that is today, till the 15th of August. This is uh, to ensure that on completion of 75 years of independence, there is a personal connection between the citizens and the Indian flag. The whole idea is to invoke patriotism on this uh, occasion in the hearts of the people and also to create the awareness about the Indian flag. The program saw the participation of students from various schools in the city, artists grouped from different areas of the state, and senior citizens.